Hey everybody. Hello, hello, hello. How's everybody doing? Not live, not live. I'm having huge problems um, with my computer. So I did this yesterday, leftovers, and I I couldn't I couldn't save the video file on my computer. So normally what I do is I take this recording, transfer it to my computer, bump up the video, uh, the audio quality, then save it, transfer it. It's a pain in the butt. So I don't know, maybe I'm just going to need to do lives. But this way, I don't know. I, I, hopefully it'll be easier. Anyway, let's get to it. So. Um, this is leftovers, but I'm going to throw a little bit of J6 in there to the hearing because that went on last night. And again, for us who are watching this channel, nothing new, um, I don't think. Oh, it had, um, I did see Josh Hawley running like a little wimp that he is. Oh no, they're after me. Jeez, can you believe it? Oh yeah, yeah. well yeah, yeah you can. Um, Marjorie Taylor Greene had a text in there and she said, guns, This there's an active shooter reported. This is not the way to deal or something. I'm like, really? Isn't that what you promote all the time? Anyway, anyway, um, before people shut me off, so important to get out and vote. Don't think it's not important. We've got to change the gun laws, another shooting in, I think, Iowa or Ohio or something. So we got to change. We've, we've got to Marjorie Taylor Greene is right. Guns are not the solution. I hate saying it like that, but she's right. Um, Trump had a meltdown, so let's look at him a little bit. Hee <laughs> hee. I mean, uh oh. So sad. Um, I'm gonna look at him at the end. I want to get to leftovers because because you guys deserve the leftovers. These are leftovers. For the questions that y'all submitted um, when I was on with Lori and Sheila, Lori, way of the positive change. So a couple of y'all asked some questions. One was, and I can't really remember, um, hang on, what you all, what a lot of the readings are. I don't remember a lot of my readings, so... Um, I do remember a couple of them, um, like, will ETs help Ukraine? We'll get into that later. Will Canada's prime minister resign? Okay, now I'm remembering. And I'm going to throw three or four cards on it anyway. But um, I didn't get him resigning so much as him just getting into a whole bunch of trouble. A lot of things coming out with him. And I don't know much about them, but um, I was using Andrea's cards because she's Canadian. And I got the guilty card. So I don't know. He could. Um, he's facing a whole bunch of stuff. So let's just pull three cards. No, heard six. Justin Trudeau. What is going on, Justin? Are you going to be resigning? And I'm going to put a time limit on it by the end of the year. Justin, are you going to be resigning? Justin Trudeau resigning by the end of the year. I can't believe it's July already. The end of July. Uh-oh. Moving on. Oh, card said it. Let me drop it down. Card said it. Not me. It wasn't me. Gotta loosen this up. Come on, down. There we go. There we go. Moving on. What's this? 
crazy. Um, four of cups. Something is being offered to him. He's not really looking at it, though. He's got a lot of things going on. He's got eight. Well, he's got um, five full cups here. And he's kind of focused on these three spilt ones. So this is kind of what I was getting before. It's kind of a mixed bag. What's he not looking at? And at the base of the reading, look at that, nine of cups. He's going, yeah, I got this. I got this. In the past, he's got some justice karma coming towards him that's going to make him move on, but somebody's going to give him an offer. At the top of the reading, what was he, because I don't know what's going on with Justin Trudeau, what was he stealing, taking? So this is the Seven of Swords. Uh, the thief sneaks into camp, takes some swords, leaving wh whoever is guarding this camp a little defenseless. That's what this card is. So he snuck in and took something. I don't know what he took. And the potential near future card is, ooh, the sun reversed. I didn't think I was reading reversals here. I guess I am. The sun reversed. So this would say, yeah, he's skating away free. He's getting out. There's no big deal. Um, whatever this movement card is, it's going to be okay. But because it's reversed, I think justice is coming after him. It's going to tarnish his wish. But he's going to skate. I think he's skating. I think he's getting away from what should be this card as justice. Okay. Does that make sense? Oh man. Like somebody comes in to my office and messes up my tripods, messes up my cameras. It's probably a little Josh Hawley running in. God dang it. He's all butthurt now. Oh my gosh, that's not, you, you, you caught me in a bad moment or something. I don't know. Josh Hawley is such a wimp. And he's from my home state of Missouri. He's such a wimp. I guarantee you, he does not chew on galvanized nails. He should. Might make him smarter. All right. Um, Jessica Watkins, one of nine Oath Keepers charged with seditious conspiracy, retracted a story in a filing that she was given a VP pass to the Trump rally, had met with Secret Service agents. Oh, my God, Secret Service agents. Oh, yeah, yeah. Um, and was providing security for legislators and others, including their march to the Capitol. Has she, she has changed the story to merely, I don't even know who Jessica, Jessica Watkins is. Okay. Oath keepers charged with seditious conspiracy. Did she change um, her story? Oh, was she the, I didn't read this. Was she the pipe bomber? Let's look at that. Um, is the crack in funding her defense? No, does that matter? But is she the pipe bomb lady? Let's look at that. I think I need Andrea's cards for that. Is she, was she the pipe bomber? Jessica Watkins. You know, they change their stories, they lie, they cheat, they get money from wherever they can. So if the Kraken attorney gave her money, yeah, and then she'll deny it. So it's, you know, it's Secret Service may or may not be covering for her, right? 
because that's a whole S in the secret service. Notice how I didn't say the word shit. Oh. So just to go on the note of the secret service, not all of them are bad. But you get a couple of few bad apples, you know what I'm saying? And that whole damn bushel gets all rotten. So I wonder if the Secret Service is going to be dissolved. I mean, they do a, a function. They do do a function. As I said, do do on the Secret Service. Okay, Jessica Watkins. Focus, focus Jessica are you the pipe bomber? Jessica Watkins. Okay, I had to make sure that I was, these are all mixed up right side up. So I got the fall card. I need my cheat sheet. I need my cheat sheet. Sorry, 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 sorry. Because I think this is a timing card, too, of fall. Aging, decaying, bad female. Oh, my God. She's a bad female. Let's keep going. Oh, Sorry, this is live too. Well, it's not live. It's recorded straight to YouTube, so I can't edit any of this. If I say something stupid, if I do that, hang on. Ooh, uh-oh, I don't like this. I think she is. Bad gal, bad woman. Um. Dropping off a little present at the base is is uh, her world is not is not set up right. It's upside down. She's got Earth up at the top. She wants. She's going. You know. Let me fix this. Let me turn this upside down world of the Democrats of of Mr. Pumpkinhead not winning, let's turn it right side up with a little present to some DNC people in the past. Up, right, positive, the top of the reading. Oh. Koala bear with his tail on fire. I don't know. I just looked at that part of it and you go, uh-oh. What does a present like what we're talking about do? Lights koala bears on fire. Balance. I'm getting, let's drop this down. Okay, I am getting the bad woman dropping off a present because the balance of things, her world is upside down. She wants to write it. So this present causes the koala bear to go on fire. She's looking for more balance. She's trying to protect what she thinks is right. She's creating chaos. She thinks she's a good guy. Did she fly away? I don't know. Did she escape? Obviously, she did. This is... Um, somebody that let's let's pull a pendulum on it let's pull a pendulum on it
Give me a circle if you're ready to read on this, please. Is Jessica, what's her name? Watkins, the person of interest, the person they're looking for. I can't even get the question out without it going yes. Did she drop off that package at DNC? That is a yes. All right. Case solved. Case solved. Uh, Jessica Watkins. Let's just see where she goes. Cool. All right. Will the Uvalde police be held accountable? Sorry. Let me, let me look at it this way. Will the Uvalde police be held accountable for the incident that led to those children? Um, this was a really hard one for me. Um, I don't like tapping into that energy. I did. And I'm just going to recount what I said, the cards I got. Um, and I was using the wild unknown deck and I got the nine of swords, which is eyeballs and body parts. That is what they are going through. These cops, they're going to be reliving that a lot over and over in their head, what they could have done, what they should have done. It's not going to let them go. Are they going to get um, be held accountable? They're being held accountable in their own minds. Um, is somebody going to put them in jail over it? I didn't see that there, but I saw so much trauma in their heads. You wouldn't want to be them. You would not want to be them. Um, Bill Gates buying up farmland so that he can create um, a new GMO strain of food so he can feed the planet. Does it sound like Soylent Green? Does it smell like Soylent Green? Does it taste like human body parts? Then it's Soylent Green. All right. Isn't that what, didn't they do that? They made food from, turned it into pills, but it was people. Ew. Donner, party of four. All right. Um, is Bill Gates buying up farmland? Is he trying to create new food? And I heard he was. Is he going to be successful in his GMO food source? Is he going to be successful? That's, that's a tricky word. That card flew out. Upside down house. Is he going to be successful? Because you don't know what success is. Is it money? Is it producing this, but it doesn't help? People are kind of, I mean, we can eat McDonald's hamburgers all day long and still be alive, but just not for long. A friend of mine who is a really good surgeon, really good surgeon, uh, retired. He goes, it doesn't matter what you eat. It's carbs in, carbs out. It doesn't matter. Calorie. I think he said calories. Calories in, calories out. Doesn't matter. I go, you're a surgeon. You open people up, split them open, take bad parts out, sew them back up again, and you don't think food matters? Good food? Which is why I trust our medical community so, so much. Okay. Sorry. Snarky. Snarky. All right. All right. All right. Um, Bill Gates. You're going to be successful in buying out farmlands, creating GMO food. What's the 411 on Bill Gates buying all this GMO stuff land? 
time. He thinks there's a time issue with this. I mean, obviously, people are starving, right? So, but there are no hands on the clock. So he's not really, there's something miss, there's something missing with that, with his logic. We got the present, but it's reversed. Let's just keep going. There's a lot of talk about it. He's a little bit guilty. Is he going to be successful? No. But he's not going to be found guilty, although he kind of is a little bit. Um, there is some sunlight that's going to come out of this, but it's just not the right time. It's not the right time. And it's clear because the present is upside down. So, yeah, he's, it's not the right time. But there is a lot of talk about it. So there. All right. Um, what else? This one. Oh, somebody wanted me to look at um, the Federalist Society and Leo Leonard, Leonard Leo. And there are certain things, energies that creep me out. And I don't want them in my life. So that's one. Um, It's creepy enough to read on Mr. Pumpkinhead. So, but that one, eh, I got it, but I just can't read on it. And our ETs helping Ukraine. And here's the message I got, but I'm going to read on it again. The message I got is that the ETs are not concerned with day to day politics. However, they are concerned if some kind of nuclear thing comes up. So they're watching. That's what I got. They're watching, but not going to step in. So let's just see what Andrea's cards have to say, because I think she might be an alien. Don't tell her I said that. Okay, here we go. Are you are ETs helping Ukraine win the war? Are ETs helping Ukraine? What's that? That's somebody looking at the world from space. Okay. It's being crossed by soon reversed. So they're not doing anything yet. They're just, they're just, kind of got their one eye on it. How many eyes do ETs have? Well, if you're a cat or pillar, I don't know why I thought of that image. You know, one of my cards has all the cats on a pillar and they have a lot of eyes. Anyway, um, the past reversed at the base. So if it's the past reversed, then it's the future. In the past, as it relates, is the black card. Go figure. They're not looking at this as like, oh, this is all lovely. No, it's dark. At the top of the reading, it's domestic. It's not of their concern. And in the potential near future, 
a rabbit coming out of its hat, but it's upside down. So they're not going to pull any magic tricks yet. Yet. I'll drop it down. Y'all can make sense of this if you want. I have them looking at the world. Soon is upside down, so it's not going to be soon. The past is upside down. So it's like, yeah, we're, we're still looking, but not. It's going to be in the future. The past is upside down. The future should be right side up, but it's, it's not. Black, domestic, and if they need to, they'll turn that card around and pull a rabbit out of their hat. Okay, so that is that. Let's look into, where are we here? 27 minutes. Okay, let's look into Mr. Pumpkinhead. Mr. Pumpkinhead. I'm going to use the wild unknown for this. So, all this time that he sat in the, in the dining room, just sat there. Um, the video that he put out, and I, I, I couldn't figure out which one was first, but I think this was the second one when he went into the next day, when he went into the, the press room and made that video and he kept, he goes, no, I don't like that word. I don't want to say the election was lost. That one. I read that that short video, that three minutes that we saw actually took an hour and something to make. Now I know how long videos take to make because this one has been trying to come up for two days. Maybe it's a piece of junk video and shouldn't be up anyway. That's a possibility. But what he was saying took over an hour to rehearse, to get it right. I would love to see that. Well, actually I wouldn't. Um, but I bet you J6 has it. So let's just dig into Mr. Pumpkinhead's energy. Ew. And see, see what the cards say. What's he feeling? What's he feeling these days? Um, it's so funny. His From the news feed that I watch, he's just blaming everybody. He's blaming Mitch. He's blaming Nancy. He's blaming, I think he even started talking about Hillary again. I'm like, really? Where's Hunter? How come you haven't blamed Hunter in any of this? So sad. So let's look at Mr. Pumpkinhead. Let's do, uh, let's just do three cards. Mr. Pumpkinhead, what are you feeling? What's going on right now? Oh, it's hiding <laughs> the hermit. Or he really pissed off Mitch McConnell. Either one, I, I think is true. Oh. Two of Cups. All right. I didn't understand the Two of Cups until this, the Five of Pentacles. So, it feels like he's hiding now. He's going into his shell again. A little crazy, though, because he's got this light on. So there's flashes of crazy coming out of his, the top of his head. Um, he's looking for 
um, uh, some kind of friendship. He's looking for some kind of alliance, somebody who will stick with him, right? And he goes, you know, it that was there. That was there. Two of cups, everybody. Yeah, it's all great, you know? It's this pal, this friendship. And I look at these roads and I, at roses, and I go, oh, that's a little love fest going on. He's got some people who, no, no. It's the sadness. It's the loss. Five of Pentacles. Devastating loss. He feels this loss. His love affair that he may have had, it's starting to wilt. And he's losing people. Now, this only has one pedal. I think, I think there's a lot more that's being lost. So let's look at the independents, at the people who called themselves Republicans. And we check in on them every now and again. Is now that J6 has, has ended season one, is this going to change the conversation? Is this going to make regular old Republicans that weren't into crazy land, is this going to make a difference in their opinion? So that we can get normal back into our government. And normal was never really normal. Let's be clear. That's my bad shuffling. There's always been shenanigans. And there still are on both sides. Both sides abusing the system. But is it going to be, is it going to make a difference so that people can start res respecting each other a little bit? J6 going to make a difference in those on the fence Republicans. Nine of Wands. Step by step. By step, are they seeing the darkness? It's being challenged by, they can't see through the forest. The Ten of Wands, they can't see the light through the forest. It's not making a difference so far. That's the challenge. At the base of the reading, Son of Pentacles. Hmm. If the King of Pentacles is... Um, senior, then is this junior or is this Son of Pentacles a new project coming out, a new path forward? Let's just see where we go. Five of Swords, the winning at any cost, the fight, 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 fight. We'll even, we'll even dismember our own. Is that where this is going? Are they splitting up? Sorry. Are they splitting up? Is the Republican Party going to split into two? Looks like it from that card. At the top of the reading is the Two of Swords. Wow. This is a choice that they need to make between light and dark. At the center of this choice is dark with passion, red, anger. Where do they want to be? Do they want to be up in that anger? That's a card we can ask ourselves too. Do we want to be up in that anger? Do we want to be in the light? Stay in the light. Stay in the light. Ah. Potential near future. Look at the two cards. There is a choice that they can make. Which card would you like to have? 
if you were going to be making a choice, the color or the dark? Now, they may not want to go with the rainbow, but the potential near future is the rainbow. I like this card a lot. They have to change from black, anger, um, darkness, falling into that dark hole into a rainbow of colors. Embrace their rainbow. Because you know they got it. It's all in there. They need to embrace it. They're hiding it away. They're going, oh, no. Oh, no. Jim Jordan. Yee. What's going to come out about him as a wrestling coach? It's just all projection on that part. All right. So um, I think that's it. Let's pull some for us. Let's pull some for us. Where's my, do I have happy cards? I do, I do, I do, I do, I do. Oops, sorry, sorry, sorry. This live stuff, even when it's not live. Thank you all for watching, for hanging, spending time with me on this. What day is it? Friday. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Maintain our compass. That was the card at the very bottom. I'm using the enchanted map just to pull a card. And that compass card, maybe that's the one that I should just leave with, but we'll see. Um, it's really important to keep our moral compass um, set up the right way. Make sure that there's going to be magnetic fluctuations because the earth is fluctuating. So got to keep checking the compass. How are we doing? Spending too much time in the negative, not enough time in the positive. We spend, can you spend too much time in the positive? Oh. Movement. That flew out when I said, can we spend too much time in the positive? I don't know what that means, so I'm going to leave that up to you all. Card for the day. Give me something that makes sense to me, please. And it's okay not to know my opinion. Like that, deep freeze. It's okay not to know. Just wait. Things will thaw out. Things will be okay. At least you're near water. Can't say that for a lot of the places on the planet. All right. Thank you all.